I was, I was sitting there and I'm going, this, it's just simple. See, and it's how Holy Spirit taught me the gospel. So the gospel's full of purpose. This thing's not just about blessing. It's not what I get from him. It's what I become now that he's in my life. It's about becoming. You don't just gather together to see what God might do and how he might show up and what we might receive. No, we gather together to stay stirred up in love and good works, which means your life is an outward expression of Christ. Are you with me? Come on, it's what Christianity is. And if that's not your goal, you're either you're going to get bored and get religious and go through the motions because you feel indebted deep in your heart to God because you believe the cross. Or, or you're going to get distracted if you don't have that kind of purpose in Christ. And all of a sudden you can do 25 years in church and never really know him and manifest him. Yeah? Yeah? You can do a daily devotion and never even connect with the Lord. The daily devotion can take the place of knowing Him. You just think the daily devotion is Christian behavior. Christian behavior is walking in love and showing mercy and making peace. <laughs> Are you with me? You all right? I'm here to stir you up this morning. I might challenge you along the way. It's okay to be challenged. I'll smile the whole way. I didn't, I'm not mad at you. I'm not one bit angry at you. I didn't come here to spank you. I didn't come here to set you straight. I just came here to tell you who you are, that Jesus did an amazing thing on the cross for an amazing reason. Let's not miss the reason. Let's not just stop with forgiveness. Let's not just stop with everlasting life. Let's start with him and let's run this race well. Are you with me?